Oh, what's up, my little detectives? Well, you already know I'm not gonna hold you. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe because I'm investigating and bringing you all the tea, okay? So, as you can already tell by the title, this week, Latoya and her little situation are in the hot seat. Last week, we investigated adam if you haven't already watched that video you need to go ahead and do so but this week it's latoya's turn and as you can tell by the time, this is a juicy one so if you haven't been keeping up or you should be keeping up with this whole debacle between adam and latoya so latoya recently brought this new guy into the picture for a, a little while now his name is von Ray. so apparently von Ray and latoya are besties so i mean all right so based on the videos that they've been doing uh, they seem cute together according to them they're just besties latoya as we know just came out of a long-term relationship and apparently Van Ray just came out of a long-term relationship as well so i guess they're just having fun doing grown people things you know being distractions to each other and based on the videos they have like good times together they're always laughing as i said they're really cute together but okay and this is a big but there have been some red flags that came up while i was watching these videos with latoya and her bestie von ray so i'm just going to get into it so the first thing that i noticed was the fact that latoya and von ray um assuming that's how he's the last part of his name is pronounced ray so anyways they have a channel together already now based on what we know von ray is a new guy and i know latoya is a smart girl a smart woman so i can't really wrap my head around the fact that they have a channel together already and then i mean latoya's name has a lot of clout behind it like Latoya is a very successful in what she does and I mean I'm pretty sure that Von Ray knows this so it's kind of not sitting well with me the fact that they have a channel together and based on how they talk it seems like Von Ray is the one that controls the channel so it's basically it sounds like it's his channel and I mean every title he is milking Latoya's name. Like Latoya's name is in literally every video. If not, like if it's not every video, it's like every other video. Or probably one or two videos don't have her name in it. So like that is a red flag for me. Like why do we have a channel together so soon? Like, hmm, versus then the next thing that i noticed in one of the videos that they did on this channel like von Rue was filming and latoya was introducing herself and then midway into latoya introducing herself von Rue cuts latoya and promotes this little gym where he's training or where he trained latoya at and I mean, as small as it is, it was a red flag for me because, you know, I'm thinking Van Ray knows that persons follow Latoya. So anything that he films with Latoya, there's going to be a lot of persons that are watching. So he's trying to promote this little gym where he trains so that persons can come there. And I mean, like, even if you want to do that, at least give the girl the opportunity to introduce herself and not cut her midway into her introduction. Like, what? 
seriously and i mean it might be small for some persons or a little thing or maybe nothing for some persons but to me that was definitely a red flag and then on top of that latoya was upset about it because when he did it she spoke to him about it and then after that it seemed like when they got into the car she was still upset about it so i mean that's a red flag i don't like that even if his intentions are good like no you don't do that you not do that so that's definitely a red flag as i said before then the third thing that i have been noticing is that vonry can be a bit pushy like he clearly wants more than just a bestie dom with latoya and he's making it known like every second like um I'm the man of your dreams. I'm the one for you. We're going to be together. We're going to have kids. Like, I don't know, but there's something about a man that is just subtle about what he wants and allows a woman to take her time and see if she's interested, see if it's really what she wants instead of pushing her into a relationship. Because to me, that's what he's doing. I mean, mind you, we don't know if they're actually in a relationship right now which that could be the case and they're not telling us but still i think a vonry has been pushy from day one i mean well that's why it doesn't really seem too bothered by it i don't like it and based on how Latoya is acting, she seems like she just wants some type of distraction in her life right now. She doesn't want anything serious. And she said it before that she's just having fun. But um, Von Ray is not, he's not satisfied with that. He wants more and he's making it known. And I don't like that. So it's a red flag for me. It's definitely a red flag. But yeah, that's my whole take on the situation. While well, Latoya and Von B are cute together, uh, I know Latoya is a smart woman and I just want her to take it slow. Don't get into her feelings with all these mushy, cute things that Von has been telling her and doing for her. Don't get in your feelings, girl. This is just a distraction. We don't want nothing serious right now. Just a distraction. Just having fun. Just for the moment. That's it. Because, listen, I've been watching Latoya for years, as I've said before. And I'm really riding with her, riding for her. I want the best for her. Especially with everything that she is going through. I really just want her to at least enjoy herself and not have to worry about a heartbreak or whatever you know and i must say i hope her grandparents are doing better i saw the videos that she did and she was really sad you know so um you know just all the best for her and her grandparents during that time yeah but that's my take on it as i said before don't forget to like comment and subscribe people and comment down below tell me what you think about the whole fun ray and latoya situation you know and tell me compare adam and latoya situation what you think about them and one thing I did pick up in the video, Latoya and Von Ray are planning to go to Tulum, which Adam and Queen Wa did go to Tulum um, recently. If you watched my last video or if you've been keeping up with Adam, you'd know that they went to Tulum as well. So I don't know if it's a little competition brewing. So yeah, I'll definitely be watching. Okay. Always be posting some good vlogs and vacations to come. Like, I think we are decided on either Tulum or Bora Bora. Let's when go I, to Tulum first. Tulum first. Yeah. It'll be our first vacation. I've been trying to go to Tulum for the longest. I want to hit that, uh, that Tulum jungle. So, I'm officially in Tulum. I'm about to do a tour. I got the Mexican George Clooney Oscar here. 